What's up guys, the Merry Gamer here, and welcome back to the Muppet Race Mania. And at the moment I'm just sitting on the stats page because I was just having a look at it, and I did go and do the Mallory Gallery off camera, and my god, that took so long to figure things out. It was unbelievable how many tricks and turns in there. Okay, so I'll go through it all. So, if you remember from last episode, there was that room near the starting line that had like a switch that you had to shoot. Well, shooting that, if you paid attention to what was on the wall, which was blueprints, which I didn't notice at the time, uh, that actually was blueprints of that center bit, how to get the movie. So you couldn't jump it, you actually had to blow up that switch to actually make it go away so you can get the movie. So that was pretty straightforward, it was pretty easy uh, when you figured it out. But the tough part was the tokens. Now, the tokens, there was that, it was only one of them that was difficult, really. Like, there was another one up the top where the dozer was, well, or doozy, technically his name is. Uh, I call it dozer, I know, I know, I say it wrong, but it's, <laughs> whatever. Um, but the tokens, uh, the, the one near the doozer was hard to get, because you had to jump over these things, and you could fall and, um, and fail. I, when I got, actually got the tokens, I did it with, like, a second to spare. But the one behind the glass at the start, that was really, really difficult. Uh, that actually, the way to do that, you had to, there was a small picture. There was a picture of Miss Piggy as the like dressed in the Mona Lisa, and there was a small little target picture next to it. I mean, really small, and it made you think you had to shoot that, but you didn't. You had to shoot the big ass picture with no target, and it actually broke the picture, and you go through around the path to where the picture frame was behind the glass. So. That, that whole level, just to figure that all out and actually try and remember how to do it, took me almost an hour just to do that. Like, the dozer was pretty straightforward. I did him pretty much straight... I did him on my first go. Um, the movie, I did it in my second go, because after I realised it near the end of the, of the first try of trying to getting it. And the tokens took me two or three goes to do, because I couldn't figure out the painting thing. Uh, because then I accidentally shot the big one, and that's how it, how I got it, because I didn't realise you had to shoot the big one. Uh, but what we're going to do here is we're going to do the adventure today in Trafalgar Square. I'm just going to take a quick sip of water, though. Alright, and let's do... We're going to do Floyd, because Floyd, I think, um, is a good character to play as at the moment. And let's do the tokens. I'm feeling the tokens should be done first. This is only a small map, so it's pretty straightforward, pretty easy. Like, we're in this room now, we've already got... Wow, there's actually five of them in this little room here. That's alright. Alright, so let's go down here. Uh, I don't know where the dozer portal is. I have a feeling it'll be on, like, on the other side over here. Which I don't want. There's the movie, so we can get him next. Um, where's the others? There's one... Oh, there's a token here, is there? No, here. Yeah, I thought I saw a token on the map. And there's another one... Oh, there's the... Oh, he's going to be hard, that little guy. We'll have to nudge him quite... We have to nudge him from here, around here. Um, that's not going to be easy. Alright, well, what we'll do is we'll go get the movie. Uh, the movie was up here. I know it was on the end of one of these. So let's get that. So now the movie's collected. Um, Alright, let, let, let's do, like, the fruit and... Let's do the fruit this time. And uh, we'll leave the uh, we'll leave Dozer for last because I have a guess Dozer is going to be the hardest one to do. I guess because we have to get him on the other side of the map. So yeah, he might he might be a bit difficult because you got the gradients in those little tunnels, so he might be a bit difficult to move. So we'll leave him to, for last so we have a few tries tries at it, and um, we'll do we'll do all the fruit and stars. First, uh, let's do this. There's a better way of getting these that I'm forgetting to do. There's a way where you should drive up, then reverse back, but angle yourself. That's what. That's how I did the fruit in the Mallory Gallery, because that was reasonably easy, but you had to go the correct way. Like, you had to go the way of the race course, I believe. It was the best way of doing it. Like, I, I did it several times, and then there was one go that I had where... Um, where I practically had almost got everything, and then all of a sudden I fell short by, I think, about six uh, fruit. I even could see the six fruit I needed, but uh, I just, um, I was going the wrong way. But then when I tried 
the other way around the course. Uh, I kept on respawning so I get it right at the uh, like the starting line, and it was perfect. It it worked perfectly. Uh, so now we'll get the, all the stars, all 36 of them, and then we'll have a go at Doozer. So let's do this. So there's only 36 stars, so it shouldn't be too bad to collect in two minutes. My biggest worry is somehow getting that Doozer guy though to his portal. Um, to his portal. I need to decide which doorway is the best to go through. We want the doorway closest to his portal. So I think it's... Is it this one that had the portal, or is it... No, he will want to go through the other doorway. I don't know if the other one had stars on the fountain. If it did, we missed them. I don't think so, though. Alright, because there's three here. And there's four there. Okay, so we need to go through the other one. So when facing him, you go through the left. Okay, so now... We now need to get this guy, this doozer guy, down. Uh, yeah, so this is not going to be easy pickings. Um, Alright, if we can just angle ourselves and give him a little nudge. He'll, he'll move easy, but he doesn't like moving too well sometimes. They get a bit weird, see? When they get stuck on walls, it's you're pretty much screwed sometimes. Uh... But we're lucky we can nudge him easily here. I'm just going to shoot him to get him to go down and make it easier for us. Oh, I hate the seals. The seals are like the worst thing to get in this. But even though that actually did hit him. But I don't know how this is going to be hard, this one. Alright, there we go. Got a good angle on him there. Can't see where he is. He's right here. Got less than a minute now. This is the hard part, so let's shoot him with that. Let's shoot him with that. And let's don't roll back down, whatever you do. Don't roll back down. Alright. Now we got 40 odd seconds to get him over here. Alright, we, 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 we can do this. We can do this. We've got this pretty easy, actually. I say that and we probably mess up now. He's so close! Oh, how did I miss that? No! Uh-oh. <laughs> okay, okay. There we go. Ah, Alright, so that's Trafalgar Square all done, I believe. If we go stats. Yep, because all we have to do is the boss battle, which we have unlocked now. Because you have to do a bit of adventure to unlock them, I believe. But see, we got the boss challenge, and that will be battle as the boss. But we're going to come back and do all the boss battles after we've done all the adventure modes. So guys, that's going to be it for this episode. Hope you all enjoyed it. Hope you all have an awesome day. And I will see you all in the next episode. Catch you later, guys.